talking about today's game, I really feel like we're going to do something special. I don't know if that's just because I've seen the City score. It's 2 all, and City have dropped points. So I'll see you in a bit. minutes in we've had one close chance uh, there's been nothing other than that in this game to be honest but we've got a free kick from about 25 yards out let's see if we can make something off this second half and as I said before we're 2-0 up quite comfortable in this game I mean player for player we're definitely better and as a team we're better anyways but there's no reason why we should concede and I think an important goal in now should be number one keep the attack strong and number two keep that bloody clean sheet because it's been too long that we've kept the clean sheet someone needs to be there Brighton players has gone flying into Mane and somehow managed to injure himself. Mane went down but he got back up within a few seconds. 
Uh, but while we're waiting for that injury to sort itself out, you're probably wondering why I want Salah to score so badly. I've got my fantasy team over here, uh, and as you can see, I've got Alexander Arnold over there, Edison in goal, which probably wasn't the best choice for today, and Salah is my captain. So hopefully, Salah can get a goal and get me double points this week. If you guys have a fantasy team as well, make sure you guys let me know in the comments below. Maybe I can make a league for next year or something like that. Here we are back to the quite uneventful second half of Liverpool versus Brighton. Come on, Robbo! Oh my god! Should have put that away. There we go, finally a decent chance this half. 64th minute and it's a corner for Liverpool. Come on, Red. Today, unfortunately not, um, but it looks like we've got a substitution here. It's Mohamed Salah coming on for Alan Milano. Interesting substitution, but I suppose it gives us a lot more control in the game. I would, honestly, I prefer to see Naby Keita on. I don't know why Naby was here recently, but I think he's crossed. But let's see what Milano has to show in, what, the last 20 minutes of the game today. Honestly, honestly, a dead game and a moment of madness. Brighton played the ball over our defence, we've got a striker running onto it, and Becker's out of the box. I think the striker beat him to the ball, so he's, I don't, like, it looked like he saved it outside the box, I have to be honest. But uh, I think he's gone straight for a red card, I don't know what's going on here to be honest. I've seen him pull the red card out, but Alisson's still on the pitch, and everyone's surrounding the referee at the moment. I might as well just show you guys. Whenever we've had Adrian on, the games have been well. Alisson Becker is so close to finally getting a clean sheet, but it looks like Becker's going to finish the game off for him. There we have it, a red card, and it's Oxley Chamberlain that's made way so that Adrian can come on. Uh, and it's a free kick for Brighton. I do not know what minute it went, it's quite late into the game. Uh, hopefully, we keep this clean sheet. Stupid, stupid, stupid goal to give away. Rest on the whistle for the free kick and they've taken it literally as the whistle goes and fallen asleep. Adrian wasn't ready, players aren't ready and gone and lost another potential clean sheet. It's shocking. Yeah, we're two on off, but we need to wake up, like. Let's calm down. It's a three points that matter. As long as you get the three points, it's all good. We can't do anything without a bit of drama, can we? We're into the 82nd minute now, and what was literally a nothing game, easy win, tuning up, three points in the bag. Just a moment of madness has changed everything. We're 2-1 two, two at the moment, and the last eight minutes of this game, we're just gonna stress the life out of me, because we need three points, we need to win, we need to freaking increase that graph on the top of the table. Oh, 
Liverpool club here and as always we can't do teams that have a bit of drama. Liverpool, you get my heart racing. Three points in the bag, unfortunately not the clean sheet that I was hoping for. There were three goals in the game but unfortunately one of them for Brighton. And in slightly better news, a loss for Chelsea, a draw for Man City and a win for Liverpool. It just makes it even clearer at the top of the table. Come on Liverpool! I hope you guys enjoyed that video anyways. Make sure you guys like, subscribe and drop a comment down below if that's it. I'll see you guys later.